how much you've developed in a couple of years? I can say the man, the development is, you know, kind of crazy. Uh, two years is a long time, but in your eyes, it doesn't seem like a long time. Uh, I've grown so much in those two years. Uh, I believe my teammates can attest to it. Uh, just maturity on the and off the field uh, has gotten a lot better. Uh, I was able to see a lot on the field and, you know, just uh, deal with people off the field, you know, just uh, getting my life together. So, you know, it's been a huge difference, man, these two years. Uh, this defense picked up some guys that could expect to step in and, and help. Did you watch much? Did you notice much of what the team did over the weekend? Yeah, I watched. We got a uh, D lineman uh, from Michigan. Man, I love his energy. Uh, he looks like a younger me, but he's as big as hell. Uh, and I know he's ready. Uh, seeing some other guys, we got some corner uh, corner come in. Uh, chopped it up with him. Uh, just, you know, just picking their brain just a little bit. Just tell them, you know, come in ready to work, man. Uh, everybody has a job. Just make sure you do yours to the best of your ability. First time we've had a chance to talk to you, Cam, since Zach said on Saturday night that uh, Dax will be in the corner room. How excited are you to have a new face that you already know in there? Man, it's going to be fun, man. That's all I can say. Uh, he's been working with us, you know, on the field during practice with, you know, the corners. Uh, instead of him running over to do the, the safety drills, he was over there with us, working on his hands and feet. Uh, towards the end of the year, all every practice. So, uh, you know, it's just reps, man. I say uh, that's just what comes with it, especially playing on the island. It's a hard position to be played and then transition from one to another. How, what, what part of his game do you think translates from safety over to corner? Honestly, just his play Red Nixon. Like, you know, I feel like at corner, I know, you know, what's coming sometimes, you know, but back there at safety, you see it a lot better. Um, I believe when he comes down, it, it won't be as hard, but most definitely it, it'll hop, happen a lot faster. Uh, you got the receiver right in your face. Um, you, you just got to be ready to go get your feet in the ground. What pick were you most fired up about when you heard their name called? Oh, man. I want to be like defensive, but I want to say offensively, uh, Mims, man. Uh, when I see him stand next to Orlando, I was kind of shocked. That's a big boy. Um, and I, and I love it, you know, protect, you know, nine. That's that's what we need. Uh, and we getting the ball back, you know, let them go have fun, you know, put some points on the board. So I was fired up about that, I'd say. You were in these guys' shoes just a couple years ago. What advice do you have for them when they try to make an impression day one? Come in and be yourself. You got drafted for a reason. Uh, don't don't try to do anything differently that didn't get you here. Uh, they know what you can do. Um, so just be yourself, like I said, stay down and, uh, you know, ball. So often you hear Cam the term soak it, soak it up like a sponge. Yep. How, how important is to be able to do that the right way? I just get, you know, kind of annoying with it, you know, to where it's kind of, you know, irritating to ask so many questions. Uh, and I think that's a good thing. Um, you know, be in these guys' ear, you know, come to me and ask me uh, any question that we have and we don't know together, let's go figure it out together. Uh, I just think, you know, this year it has to be one of those things where everybody's on the same page, uh, even the young guys. You never know what will happen, you know, in any situation. So, you know, next man up and, you know, uh, he has to have the same knowledge as the next person. No problem. Thank you.